Okay. Yes, today. Listen, in English, there are six tenses. That's it, six verb tenses. Okay? Let's do a real quick review and then we'll... You have the simple. And I would write this down. Okay, this is really important. If, that's it, there's six verb tenses. And if you know the six verb tenses, you can do anything with a verb. Okay? So you have simple present. You have simple, what do you have? Tell me, tell me, tell me. What do I have? Simple. Simple past. Simple past, good. Simple past. What else? Simple. Present. Simple future. Good. Okay. And then I've got, today we're talking about present perfect. Perfect. Yep. What else? Past present. Past. Past present. Perfect. Present. Perfect. Yep. Past perfect and guess what? Future. Future. Yes. Future. Perfect. Perfect. There you go. Alright, now let's talk in just a second. Let's give an example of each one real quick. So let's say what verb, what am I doing? Walk. Walk. So give me a sentence. I walk. walk. He walks. Thank you. Excellent. Be very, very careful. He, she, and it all have an S on the end in the simple present. Okay? I, we, you, and they, no S. This is really difficult for students, okay? Simple past, I walk. Good. Walked. 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 Hey, listen, depending on the ending of the word, it can sound uh, an ED ending can sound like a t. Walked. 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 Yes. Walked. It could sound like an ED. Lived. Lived. If the verb ends with a vowel, it sounds like an ED. Lived. Lived. Yep. Okay. Showed. Showed. A walk sounds like a T. Walked. When you have a consonant like that, it sounds like a T. But it's spelled like E-D. I walked. What is it for he? He. He. He walked. Good. He walked. She walked. They walked. It's all the same. It's easy. Okay? All right. Simple future. I Future. Walking. Walking. I. Walking. I, I am walking. I will. I will walk. I will, yes. Okay. I will walk. You with me? Okay. Now, listen. For each one of these, you have to use a form of have plus verb three. Verb three is the past participle. Okay? You have to use a form of have plus verb three. So today we're talking about the present perfect. Okay? Listen, verb three is usually, it usually looks like a past tense verb with an ed on it. But be careful, there are irregular verbs that have funny endings on them. Okay? So you have to memorize those. By the way, did you know on the back of the book, there's a list that you should work on, okay? If you look in the back of the book, you guys see the vocabulary, okay? On page 149, it's very important that you know the meanings and the spelling of these words. And then I believe we also have... 149? 149 is the vocabulary, that's right. And 